this is number four, a number of 1004. Take six, that's what the six is. My dog's real restless tonight. Okay, this is on the camera that I'm using. It's so, it's so common, I don't think I need to show a picture of it. Kodak ZI8. It's to my right, on sitting on a table. That's to my right. And it's on a mini tripod mounted, pointed down at me. Um, I have a weight on it to, so it doesn't move. I line it up to this, as you can see, the right part of the pictures to the, on the, on the right side is to the right side of this. That's what I use to get the left and right. I always look at this. And then at the top, I look at the top of the, uh, the board here. So there's my top edge and my right edge. And they stay the same. So if I bump the camera or tripod, I can move it back. <coughs> the sound from the keyboard first goes to this Olympus LS10. Let me show you. It's about the size of a micro cassette player. It's flashing right now because the um, the sound's going through. If I turn it off, there's no sound. <coughs> the pow the signal's coming from the keyboard through the line input of this, going out through the earphone out, and that out goes to the auxiliary in of this micro CD player that's made by Philips. So I think a five five CD holder. Um, it's fairly small, maybe about 14 inches high, 8 inches wide, 18 inches deep. And it's got two two separating speakers left and right. <coughs> it's not terribly expensive, but it's pretty good quality. So the way I'll be recording the um, the audio performances, the samples, the, the examples of the sounds, those will be recorded on a Olympus LS10 at this sampling rate, 48K, 24-bit PCM. It's just a higher sampling rate than, than uh, MP3 files. It has a lot of different settings as it goes up to 96, 98K. Um, I don't know how many bits, a lot of bits. And <clears throat> the sampling rate, the file sizes were uh, very big with the high rate. I found out this sampling rate, the file size, for the same amount of time, is e pretty close to the Kodak. So if I want a two gigabyte file, will take like an hour and a half, and a two, giga two gigabyte file will take about an hour and a half. So th that's what I like about those two numbers. Um, this I'm recording at 720, 60 frames per second, which I don't think is taking pictures at 60 frames. See if that shows up, how, how that comes in motion. Um, supposedly, the, the ZI8 goes to 30 frames per second in low, low light. Um, I didn't know that. Uh, I bought it because I had an external speaker, external microphone jack. And so I was going to record from some microphones connected, um, placed at the other end of the room, and get like a hall effect for, so the sound would be coming from these speakers go into the microphones. Oh, <clears throat> so I got some external microphones for the Z8 and they didn't work out. There was some Shure SM57s and, and really good microphones for the, for the uh, under 100 bucks a piece and, and the, uh, uh, just too high, too high end for this low end camera. Uh, so you have to get some, you have to get powered, self-powered microphones I think. So. So I, when I had that failure with microphone, I, I remembered I had this device that I had for many years and never really used it that much. Um, <clears throat> so I started playing through the speakers of this, recording directly with this recorder's microphones. Um, I'll show them to you again. They, the left side and the right side, they go up at angles. They do a really good job. I'm, I can get some really good sound quality. When, when this LS10 is placed at the other end of the room <coughs> and the sound comes from the, the speakers, the problem with that, and that's why I'm on take number six, uh, is external noises. Uh, 
tonight my dog was restless sometimes most of the times it's, it's uh, Isaac is like that he, he's moaning and groaning about something he does have a bad back so some of it's legitimate uh, between one of these takes I gave him a half hour massage I think it was between number one and number two and it has it hasn't seemed to help that much though so um, need to keep track of these videos one of the, another reason I'm doing sometimes I have to do more take I go over 10 minutes so the camera is the Kodak CI8 audio the audio that in, in these introduction tape uh, videos like this video that you're listening and all the previous one two three the sound is coming directly from the Philips speakers to the camera the quality is very poor compared to what I can do with this method so in future videos on the sounds, I'll be using the audio directly from this sampler rate audio file and add it to this movie file and del delete the original audio file using Sony Vegas, uh, about their $100 version. They have versions from $80 to $600. Um, I think the, the 80s, the standard def and the, and the 100 is you shop around and get it for 100 I think it's retail like 29 but uh, um, so I think that's about it for this uh, Kodak I hope this tape will do I'm going to finish off and the next video will be number five